Welcome to We Dig, the show where we talk about music, food, and discovering the amazing city of Toronto. My name's Laird. Wait a second. Why are you wearing a suit? We're doing the underground today, man. We're right downtown. I had to suit up. You didn't get the memo? Damn it. Rafi. That's Rafi. And here's what we dig. are downtown at 220 Bay Street at a place that's referred to as The Secret Salad. It's actually called Mam Green, but we affectionately refer to it as The Secret Salad. My first experience with this place was I came downtown, I had just come from working at Van Bloor, and I was in love with a salad place, and it was in the routine of eating a salad every day. Once I came down to this location, it was kind of hidden, it was tough to find. One of my friends kind of took me through a maze to get me to the place, and I finally got there, and I took my first bite, and I was sent back to the salad place at Bay and Bloor. It turns out it's the same supplier and same group of a place that's there that's called Salad Days. Immediately fell in love with this place. Plus, at the time of the shooting, it's one of the least expensive salad places that's in the underground. What I normally order when I come here is the Cobb salad. I find it's a staple to coming here. So the Cobb salad has chicken, avocado, tomato, cucumber, normally your choice of lettuce or spinach or whatever type of leaf you want. They have other options like fatouche, they have falafel, they have straightforward Caesar if you want, and they also have wrap versions of all of these. So if you don't necessarily want a salad, you want a little bit of carb in what you're eating, uh, you can also get it in a wrap form. Now this place has been known to have some pretty serious lineups, but what I love that they've introduced about a year ago is the Ritual app. So now I can actually be from my desk, order my salad, come down, pick it up, head right back to work if it's one of those busy days. So not only are they a secret salad, not only are they a delicious salad, but they're also an efficient salad. So here's the secret way to the secret salad place. First, you gotta go to the TD Towers. Those are at King and Bay, downtown Toronto. Two, you go to the TD Tower, which is right at Wellington and Bay particularly. And in the lobby, there's a set of steps that are just this way. <coughs> Once you make it through those doors, there's a set of steps that are just this way. Once you get down the steps, you should be here. Next, you just have to head down this hallway. Here's where most people get lost. You don't go up the escalator, you gotta go down the hallway. Now you're gonna wanna go all the way down the hallway to where it says 220 Bay Street. Once you make it through these doors, you walk down these steps and down a hallway. Once you've headed down that hallway, you've made it. You're in salad paradise. It's been a long journey to get to this point. Now we made it. We made it. We made it to the secret salad place, and now we can dig in. So excited. Got a little hot sauce on here just for some extra love. Rafi, are you DFL? I am, I'm definitely down for lunch. Cheers. Oh, man. What I love about the salad, because I'm actually not normally a salad guy, is that there's so many different flavors that's in here. So it's kind of a nice break from your day if you're having a tough work day to have a good meat in there. Uh, and it's a marinated meat, so it's a little salty. Some avocado in there that's normally soaking in lemon, so you got a little, a little bit of that lemon flavor too, which is great. Then you have the falafel, which offers another kind of savory type of flavor the whole thing. Each bite you'll find is a little bit of a different adventure, especially when they got hummus in it. They just have so many different ingredients and there's a fantastic diversity of texture. Such a colorful path. Find that not every bite tastes the same, but they're all so good here. All fresh. There's a burst of freshness in your mouth. They are in here the beginning of every day cutting up their vegetables to make sure that they are fresh. So unlike some of the other salad places, which just stick them in the containers and leave them out for the whole day for either for you to serve yourself or for them to serve to you, they're cutting them up fresh so that they haven't sat out for a while. So if you work downtown, if you're ever in the downtown corner and you're looking for a healthy lunch, not a lunch like a fried lunch, a healthy lunch, you can find it in the underground. We've told you how to get here. Hit up Mam Green. You will not regret it. That was this episode of We Dig. If you like us, hit that like button. If you want to come downtown and suit up with us, hit that subscribe button. Don't be shy. Leave some comments. Say if you like it, if you don't like it. We're also on Twitter and Instagram, so hit us up there. Otherwise, my name's Laird. 
That's Rafi, and we'll see you next time. I look amazing right now. I look so good right now. <laughs> but this isn't just a salad. This is an adventure. <laughs> exactly. Sorry, that was this episode of We Dig. I always call it different stuff. That was... <laughs> we trench. <laughs> Can't make up my mind. Is it We Dig or what we dig? Basically, if you're not ready to commit, but you still want to get a little, you know, into it, lentil soup. I could have done it with that one. This one, I just didn't know how to I don't even know how to explain it. It's so good. It feels good inside. It just feels good. I want more.